Hello, and welcome to another great, amazing book show. Today's story... Flight School by Lita Judge. Creator of Red Sled and Red Hat. I haven't read those, have you? This penguin is ready to live on the wind. Have you seen a penguin before? They don't fly. They are what you call a flightless bird. Like an ostrich, or a kiwi, or a pelican. No, pelicans fly. There's not that many flightless birds. Chickens can get up in the air a little bit, but they don't, uh, they don't do a whole lot of soaring. Right, come here! Come here! I was hatched to fly, said Penguin. When do classes start? But you, dear, are a penguin, teacher replied. Undeniable, said Penguin, but I have the soul of an eagle. Flight school, we teach birds to fly. Teacher and Flamingo weren't too sure, but they let Penguin stay. Flight practice started immediately. Like this, flip, flap, flap, and up, up, up. Penguin and the other birdies practiced for weeks. There they go. At last, all the birdies were cleared for their first flight. One by one, they took to the wind. And then it was Penguin's turn. Geronimo! Whoa, he's fallen. Whoa, no, oh! Gublub. He's underwater. Look, you can see Teacher and you can see all the fish. The fish are not happy to see him. I'm sorry, Birdie, said Teacher. Penguins just aren't built to fly. How can this be true, thought Penguin. In my heart, I live on the wind. But as he watched his classmates fly high above, he knew it was time to go home. Penguin was too brokenhearted to even wave goodbye. His teachers didn't know what to do. Flight school. We teach birds to fly. Then Flamingo had an idea. Wait! <gasps> they, took, uh, they took some bobbers and uh, some fishing line and they put some feathers. They all shared their feathers. Let's try again. Flip, flap, flip, flap, flap, and up, up, up. Suddenly, Penguin was soaring above the sea in the clouds. Penguin was right. He did have the soul of an eagle. He just needed a little help with the technical parts. But however he felt inside, he still had the body of a little round. Penguin. But Penguin didn't care. He had soared on the wind just as he had done in his dreams. He left flight school a happy little penguin. It wasn't long before he came back. Oh, he has, he has an ostrich friend. My friend Ostrich has the soul of a swallow. Eep. Do you know what a swallow is? They're a little bird about that big. And an ostrich is the largest bird on the face of the planet. Not probably possible for an ostrich to fly. Hope you enjoyed flight school. I don't think an ostrich can fly. This program is brought to you by Fabufkawer. Free books for kids who hate reading. Uh -uh.